In May 2014, a team from TWICT, now the innovations team from the Transport and ICT Global Practice, traveled to Dar es Salaam to conduct the first set of workshops to support the Tanzania Open Data Initiative project. The goal of TODI or TODI, a $5 million technical assistance activity funded by DFID, is to foster an organic and user-driven community around open data. It's framed by an energetic mandate at the highest levels of government towards building an open data ecosystem, in keeping both with the country's open government partnership commitments and with the Prime Minister's big results now success indicators in priority sectors including water and education. TODI also accompanies a major open government and value for money World Bank project. The first goal of this trip was to conduct workshops with the National Bureau of Statistics and the e-government agency, the two agencies charged with managing Tanzania's open data infrastructure. This included a week-long training session about CCAN, a popular open data management tool, and concluded with the e-government agency actually setting up their own instance of CCAN, which has already begun to evolve into the country's open data portal. CCAN is an open source uh, data platform for installing a I mean, to collect data from different organizations. Yeah, we install it here. It's currently. The second goal was to build a better understanding of good data management tools and practices within the Ministry of Water, a BRN priority sector. This was facilitated by Open Knowledge's School of Data program. We started out by collecting all the different data that the people work with in their daily lives. And this was a very interesting exercise because it surfaced a lot of similarities on the one hand and also showed how, how diverse the data is we're dealing with. And in the end, we decided to take a deep dive in some of the Ministry of um, Water's data on water points and start to analyze this as a group, start to see um, what we can do with this data. We identified some issues with the data we're trying to fix and where we actually go straight into creating visuals and maps. Now with this uh, Go Go Refine, I see some mm -hmm. easiest ways to work on doing with data, especially in the filter link to see if we are, you have you go, go two water points with the same code, and also in also taking uh, working with different sheets. Yeah, but the previous we cannot do that. Actually, I think I'll doing this one in our club club. There's actually excitement within uh, with the participants on Fusion Tables. It's even after lunch, uh, people are still diving deep and seeing what they can do, all kind of stories they can tell with the data they already had, and even asking more questions on how can we publish this data, how can we make it more available for them. Um. Sandwiched between these activities were various informal events, such as a hackathon to prepare for two related innovation fund activities, that proved essential to building a sense of community and pride around Tanzania's emerging open data ecosystem. The two-week schedule concluded with a roundtable discussion about decision-making dashboards. Public-facing service delivery dashboards are required both by Big Results Now and the country's OGP commitments, so a collaborative discussion with stakeholders, including the ministerial delivery unit responsible for achieving the BRN goals in water, was held to generate a user-defined set of requirements for dashboards that will help the Ministry of Water achieve its BRN targets. Underwriting these activities is an inclusive, iterative, cautious, and adaptive approach that empowers the users, both citizens and government agencies alike, to play an active and excited role in building their own open data ecosystem. This was the first of three years of TODI activities. Next steps include supporting a similar activity in education, while also leveraging this momentum to continue building an open data portal and dashboards.